Lewis Alessandro, welcome to Notts County. You must be delighted to get this deal over the line and get your contract signed. Yeah, uh, really happy. Um, as soon as I uh, heard there was interest, I was obviously immediately uh, very interested myself. You know, obviously with um, what happened with my former club last year was uh, a very, very disappointing end to the season. Um, you know, I was gutted. Um, but, you know, I, I know that I still wanted to play league football. Um, so when the chance arose, I sort of um, grabbed it with both hands. Have you spoke to the manager or the chairman yet about the ambitions for the club and trying to move it forward? Yeah, well, I, I, uh, I don't think I'd have come here if I didn't think um, we had um, you know, a good shot at shot, um, you know, doing well this season. You seem to have a pretty consistent goal scoring record for the level. I think you got 25 across two seasons with Plymouth, you got to nine last year, almost double figures in assists as well. You seem like a pretty productive player. Uh, yeah, I'd, I'd like to think so, um, but I'd probably say I've not scored enough in my career. Um, but I think the fact that I've played um, left, right, you know, number 10, I played played some part in uh, centre midfield as well last year. Um, it's obviously not that massive. Um, you know, Ullman, I need to score a lot of goals, but I, I, I do like playing down the middle. But um, I am a player that can play in, you know, multiple three, four positions. I think um, in the lower leagues, with you know the size of the squad you have, it, it definitely helps. Yeah, that versatility has been, been a key part of the squad. What what do you see in, in the Knox squad that you know of that makes you think that they can be up there challenging for promotion next season? I think you just got to look at it from, from when the gaffer came in. Um, you know, the, the results since since the gaffer came in. Um, someone asked me before, do I know anyone already here? And I, I couldn't believe it. It's the first time I've ever joined the club and I didn't actually know anybody. Um, so it's a completely fresh start for me and I'm, uh, I'll be looking to, forward to you know meeting the lads and um, because obviously everyone's uh, completely fresh face to me, so but I'm looking forward to it. Let's talk about the medical. It's obviously absolutely boiling out here today. It must have been one of the more difficult ones you've had during your career. It was. It's the toughest I've ever had, to be fair. Yeah, uh, the heat didn't help. We did. Um, I think we did a 1600 meter run. Um, but no, it, it was good. Um, you know, it's, it's just the way of the world these days. You've got to make sure you're right. Um, and uh, to be fair, it's the first bit of exercise I've done in a few weeks because I, um, I, feel, I feel like I know my own body at this my age now and I needed the rest. So, uh, no, it was good and I uh, enjoyed it. I don't think I need to go to the gym today anyway.